What's up guys, Sam Mosapor here with another tutorial for you. In this tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you how to fix the rhythm on samples or vocals like rap vocals, but generally samples that are off beat slightly and you can adjust them to make them go on beat. And I'm gonna show you using a sample here. So I'll play you the one that's, um, I'll play the one that's not on rhythm first. And then I'll play you the one that's on rhythm. So this is not on, this is not on rhythm, but it has a tempo tra a click track on it, so you can hear that it's not on rhythm. Thinking about tomorrow clears away the cobwebs and the sorrow till there's none when I'm stuck with a day. So it's almost there, but it's not really quite there. And what we're going to do now is I'm just going to take you through um, the process of what I've done above. As you can see, it's colored green and orange and shit. So here's what you're going to do. Okay, you're going to go flex. And I'm pretty sure it's the same in Logic 10. And you can only do this in Logic, I believe. Pro Tools doesn't have this option. But um, maybe, I don't think FL has it either. But maybe some other programs have it. Anyways, so you go to flex. And then you go to polyphonic. It'll recognize it for you. Mine's already set up, so it, it knows what to do. But um, let me just show you what that sounds like once it's already matched up. Thinking about tomorrow clears away the cobwebs and the sorrow. So what you want to do is you got to zoom in a little bit, okay? And generally speaking, um, it lines up with the, with the lines. So you just got to play around to see where you want to line it up to, right? So you can line it up to a specific bar. And the way you do that is you create a marker. It recognizes some markers. You double click to turn it off. You click once to turn it on. And you just basically do that. One thing you want to avoid, though, is basically, let me just show you this. So I'm going to un undo these, okay? Okay. Let's start there. So say, say I wanted to make this, this sample right here. Okay. Say I wanted to make it like that. Now, if I do that, right, something like so, if I do that, it's going to kind of mess up the rest. So what you want to do is for every sample that you're going to, that you're going to put on rhythm, you have to put a marker where you want to start it and then where you want to end it so you can fix only that part and then and then you probably want to have those markers after too so that way it doesn't flex anything else but only the in between if that makes sense so let's try it again i'm just going to show you like for example you know uh here okay so boop 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 So, let's go through it together. When I'm stuck with a day. So, what I want to do is have this go similar to exactly like how it is up here, right? So, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to set a marker there. Okay. I'm going to set a marker here. I'm going to drag this to where I think it belongs. And then, I know it belongs here, but otherwise I would listen to it. And then I would drag that there. And now it's matched up again. So that was quite easy, as you can see. And it's up to you and use your ears to find out where, where it is that you got to um, set those set those markers at. And then you can, it's generally at the beginning of a, a, a word or a phrase. And then you match it up to a bar nearby. Or you can fuck around a little bit and just experiment and see if, See if you can come up with something creative. But this is really, really cool for sampling. I use it all the time to sample. And uh, this sample turned out really great. I can show you guys a little bit. This is going to be a, we're going to make a song out of this, but uh, I'll just play it. I'll play it from over here. I'm going to bring in the bass for you. Actually, we're not going to bring in the bass for you. So, something like. 
I'll play you the violin too. Yeah, so there you have it, folks. Just a little sampling. So thank you for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe. I appreciate it. If you have any questions, you can leave it in the comments. And if you want to download some of these samples, I'm going to post them up. I'm going to post them up. This is from a film, so um, I'm just going to take responsibility for this. But um, if you want to download some samples, I'm going to put some more sample packs up on my Patreon page. I'll add a card in the corner on the top right there, and you can also uh, check it out in the description. So thanks for tuning in, guys. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.